All right, guys. Today, it's going to be a local SEO case study update. So, um, if you guys want to see more local SEO stuff, comment local SEO for the YouTube algorithm. Um, just local SEO in the comment section. It's very easy. Um, I don't think people even care about local SEO anymore. I don't know why. It's probably the most profitable channel um, to get started. It's fucking easy. I literally laid out step by step for you guys. And uh, yeah, let's let's get to the creatine, huh? So um, instead of just creatine, we're doing a bonus episode today. Uh, we got the psyllium husk. The psyllium husk kind of just looks like this. It's just powder form. And um, for every five grams of psyllium husk, there's 4.5 grams of soluble, soluble fiber. So it's about 90% fiber. It's pretty sick. Um, yeah, yesterday was Friday. Um, from, so from 9 p.m. to 10 p.m., uh, it's like free drinks at the bar here. It's great. Um, drinks are typically, I think it's because Maldives is a Muslim country. So, uh, yeah, drinks are fucking expensive here. It's like, it'd be like 40 bucks for a cocktail U.S. Insane. Um, here we go. Let me show you guys. It looks pretty nasty. I don't know if you guys see this. Oh, God. Yeah, here we go. It's thick. It looks like oatmeal. Here we go. I mix this up. But anyways, like I was saying, um, guys, local SEO is too easy. Rank and rent is too easy right now. Obviously, with my videos, more people are going to join the game. But fuck it, right? Um, we can all make money. Here we go. massive lump that was pretty gross um probably won't do that again actually um fully disgusting so yesterday um we did exactly five thousand six hundred and forty six dollars um amazon at 21.87 media vine at about 15.29 uh fan fuel cell health combined to be like 21 dollars pathetic only fans at about 1.9 k um let's take a look at amazon numbers with levanta and uh, then we can get on with the episode. All right. So yesterday, total order revenue are 40.4K. Um, earnings are down bad, uh, but I'll be fine. It's pretty solid still. So, um, yeah, I'll just be just fine. Let's take a look at Levanta. As you can see, clicks also fucking down. But, um, yeah, we're going to keep on trucking here. What are we at? $172 a day. You know, we take those. Um yeah, let's chat about today's case study, all right? Um, well, the SEO case study. So, um, Movement Room was the Physio East Vancouver case study. And we just started hitting, you know, we started edging upwards of uh, the top three. So this, anything in green means we're in the snack pack for um, local SEO. And uh, I guess you guys know what local snack pack looks like. Let me show you guys one second. So the snack pack pretty much is this place. And uh, what this shows is if you're searching from these locations, like these f five, six, seven points, we're in the top three. Um, and this is, this was super easy. Um, I documented exactly what I would do or exactly what I did. And um, first link in the description, you sign up for the first link in the description, you get this sheet, you get all the other previous um, working documents and for today's episode that reference is march 23rd episode 135 and uh yeah you just go in and i pretty much bought citations uh, i talked about this several times so if you're going to ask me exactly what i did download the sheet all right uh i bought hella citations i think it was like 200 citations from this guy uh and then I tiered it with Kevin's PBN. And in the PBN, I um, embedded uh, schema plus plus uh, embedded a map, like a Google Maps location in there too. Um, in case you're wondering what it looks like, let me show you. All right, so um, these were the links that were pointing to the citations. And then you check, you, you scroll down, and you're like, hey, Jackie, aren't PBNs dangerous? Why would you link out to something? 
and you click the link and it's linked to the citations. So what, what, what we did here was we had a PBN, we pointed it to a citation, do number one, juice it up, number two, get it indexed, and the PBN itself, the post itself acts as a citation, look. And if you notice, we did this intentionally, we did not allow the URL to be clickable. So it's just a pure citation, cannot be penalized because what the fuck are you going to do? It's not even, un, it's not even a, what is it called? It is not a sketchy backlink because there's no backlink here. The only backlink is out to a citation. I guess you can argue that's, that's not good, but all these are no follow. What are you, what are you, you going to do about it? Right. And a map embed. Right? So guys, there's a lot of creative ways you can do, um, to like deal with something like this. But, um, so right now, as you can see hovering here, I'm doing a secret HVAC case study in London. And, um, I think we're a week in and we started popping up top three for certain locations in London already in the HVAC niche. Shit's easy as fuck. All right. So if you guys want access to the secret <coughs> sheet, you're going to have to sign up for the advice community. All right. Um, and once you're in, ask Sean, Sean, my, my co-founder or my uh, co-owner of advice community to add you into the secret Slack channel. And what he'll do is he'll check that. He'll make sure you're not a Google employee because some of you motherfuckers are sketch as shit. And you got, we got some snakes and fucking snitches among us. So, you know, you just got to be careful. All right. Um, anyways. <clears throat> get added to the channel. You get access to the secret sheet. And then I lay out literally step by step what I do on each step. Um, highly recommend you join. It's fucking like $89 a month. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure it's well worth it. Number two, also make, make sure you join as soon as possible because our price is actually going up to $99 a month right now. Um, mostly because we've hit over 250 members and we just jack up the prices every uh we jack up the prices every 50 members and we have a hard cap at 350 mem uh 350 members it's uh yeah it's gonna be a good one anyways uh if you guys like today's episode i'm um, gonna spend the next couple minutes answering your questions uh remember to comment local seo if you like these type of episodes it's i think it's pretty informative um but let me know all right, so this guy asks, how long am I in the Maldives for? I think we've got five more days or four more days from here. Seems like you can appeal from a Google penalty if it's manual one, right? Yep. I couldn't find an appeal for a website that has been clapped by an algo update, uh, SEO office. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the case. With the algos, there's a couple things you could do. Um, I've talked about it several times. There's the Hail Mary. There's the Revive plugin way. And yeah, um, that's the only way I've seen people recover from the HCU. So yeah, g give it some thought. How do you tell people who are paying for guest posts that you're going to delete their posts? By the way, the post isn't indexed anymore due to this recent update. Yeah, it's uh, just tell them our site got penalized. Site is de-indexed. We didn't want to fucking get your sites clapped. So that's what we did. We we're removing them. You're welcome. Yo, Jackie, love the hustle even when you're in paradise. Yeah, the, the air quality here is terrible, by the way. It's like that of Beijing is really bad. A uh, question about clap recovery, your Hail Mary method from an older video. What's the difference between moving the content to a new website and just changing the domain of a clapped site while only keeping the best content in both scenarios? What's the difference between moving the content to this and just changing it? Um, it's the same thing. So in, in my Hail Mary method, I never, and I repeat, never redirect the domain because uh, redirections actually pass on penalties. So just remember that. All right. Don't get fucking clapped. You idiots. All right. Um, sorry. Didn't mean to call you guys idiots. It's just, just have to specify with some people. All right. Um, anyways, more comments. Let's check it them out. Love the channel, man. Can you do a video about your team, the structure, how many members? I think we're at like 15 bunch of editors, uh, one EA slash, um, operations and one director of operations costs and we're at like six seven k a month in payroll um yeah hope that answers your question i've had manual penalties removed the site's never ranked again it was like they had the pe <laughs> penalty shadow on them um i'll keep you guys updated if that's the case that would suck 
do you fish man i would do anything for a spot like that have bait out constantly <laughs> and dinner a little sorry i'm a silent subscriber i like your work ethic want to see your journey progresses also have slight interest in the topic as i'm ranking uh sites during the days of panda penguin etc just had to comment because that location is triggering fish fomo i live in finland and the water's frozen until may i did do some fishing um but uh, not here also fun fact the law in maldives states that you can only catch fish by li line caught like you gotta fucking like you they, they don't do the nets here because it's more sustainable um which is great because there's a sh the sheer abundance of fish here it's incredible um yeah like you jump in and there's just like hundreds if not thousands of fish just around you the whole time it's absolutely amazing stunning everyone looks like a fish from finding nemo they're brightly colored um i saw one like this the size of my arm yesterday uh pretty scared actually because he just came up right behind me um but yeah that's it for today guys if you guys like today's episode comment youtube seo or local seo and subscribe to the channel um our channel's kind of popping i'm kind of into it but what i've noticed is you motherfuckers only click when i get clapped and if the word clapped is in the title i'm not gonna i'm not gonna include it all right just kidding You're probably gonna try to fi find some way to squeeze in the word clapped in today's episode um i'll see you guys tomorrow